Hello everyone and welcome back to our series of video tutorials at Advanced Web Ranking. My name is Bogdan and in this video you will learn how to set up AWR to track the results that are most relevant to you. Getting the most accurate rankings is paramount when you want to correctly assess the gains of your optimization work. With the right search engines, you can set up a tracking campaign to accurately reflect the rankings of search results exactly the way they appear in the SERPs. By default, a Google Desktop Universal search engine is suggested. If we type a term, like vegetarian recipes, in Google, we can see a variety of universal search results besides the standard organic listings, such as featured snippets, people also ask, and the list can go on. Results like these will appear to your target audience when querying for this particular term. If you want to track organic positions only and do away with universal results, you can add a Google Desktop Organic Search Engine. Another highly important aspect influencing the accuracy of your rank tracking is location. Searching for dessert from a location like Queens, New York, for instance, will give us results that are most relevant to this location specifically. Tracking on a custom location search engine will give you the ranking results exactly the way they appear in a search from your location or the location of your client. You can search either in the general area of a city or a specific address, which you can narrow down to street or zip code level. Tracking location-based results organically will reveal the most relevant organic rankings appearing in searches from that specific location. You can also track local packs or concentrate on local packs only. Universal tracking will automatically show you organic results, local pack listings, maps, and all results that are generated for a specific location. When tracking results such as local packs or maps, certain result listings will appear in the SERPs with only the business name, which is defined in Google My Business, as opposed to the URL. Therefore, adding a custom value alias with your business name to the project settings is going to make sure all results will be tracked, with or without a URL. More information on that in our online documentation. If your Google Search Console shows traffic coming to your website from mobile search, you can also add a mobile search engine and see the way results appear when searched from mobile devices, either universally or organically, to people searching from across the country or a specific location. Now let's go to a project which is already updated and explore the differences between universal and organic tracking. A Google Desktop Universal search engine will count all result types and display them in your keyword rankings. In the SERP features column, results that are highlighted in green show you if your website is ranking on a particular type of SERP feature. If your website is only ranking organically, you can take a look at the SERP features column and see what other types of results are triggered by this keyword. This will give you a glimpse on how competing websites are optimized. In this case, the ranking position of an organic result will be counted in the order in which it appears in the search results page. If a feature snippet or another type of SERP feature occurs above an organic result, then the organic result will be given a lower ranking position universally. In this example, above the first organic position, there is one feature snippet and there are four people also ask results. Therefore, Vegetarian Recipes is ranking as an organic result on the sixth position universally. If you're tracking on an organic search engine, only organic results will be counted, in the order in which they appear in the SERPs from the highest ranking organic position, and the results such as SERP features will not show in rankings. Therefore, on a Google organic search engine, Vegetarian Recipes is ranking on the first organic position. You can further explore the difference between organic and universal tracking as well as how rankings look when tracking on a specific location with a side-by-side -side comparison of your rankings based on the search engines you're tracking. Remember, you can set AWR to pick up your rankings exactly the way they appear in the SERPs listings and according to the most relevant types of results that best reflect your optimization. Thank you for watching and please be sure to check out our other video tutorials.